do you think, because you've uh, been big with the juke music, mm -hmm. do you think that you kind of made a sound for the Tampa area with juke music? Uh, and, and like that's all people want to hear from the Tampa artists? Or uh, can it be a whole nother thing? Because that's real big. That's always been big and always going to be big. Yeah, it's big. But, you know, in the game, the sound is a little different as far as the universal game. And I wouldn't, I wouldn't take full responsibility for the sound of Tampa uh, as far as the juke part because really, really I came into a platform that was already kind of laid out, which was, you know, the shit T Tampa Tony mm -hmm. was doing, the shit Rated Auto was doing, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying, the shit Kaya was doing, mm -hmm. you know what I mean, Uwe Jive and all the yeah. niggas that came, you know, before me. That's the shit that they was doing, so I kind of just really – was always a little rap nigga that can spit for real, but I just kind of jumped into what was going on already because that's what was going on. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But if we was motherfucking, if them niggas was doing battle rap, then it just would have, you know, that's what I would have been doing. Right yeah. That's what the way it was. So, But I like to call mine gangster crank instead of juke because I always was coming with the gangster shit on the juke beats. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And that's why I like, you know, all the street niggas they have, they can they can fuck with my shit and relate to it because I was always coming with the gangster shit on the juke beat. As far as uh Tampa artists, right? Uh, do you feel like you are it, the burden is on you to make Tampa a nationally known city for rapping? No, I don't feel like the burden on me. I feel like I feel like um, how can I word it? Like far as Tampa being a national platform, like getting on that national platform, like the long way, the long way. I just feel like Tampa just need to keep working. Tampa got a lot of talent, you know what I'm saying? We got a lot of niggas jamming. We got a lot of young niggas jamming, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's just a matter of time. Like, it's mm -hmm. going to be a fucking hug. You know yeah. what I'm saying? It's going to be a music hug, you feel me? I just feel like I'm one of the, you know, the front runners for the shit, you know what I'm saying? So that's why I keep my game the way I keep my game and I make sure I keep my game the right way, you know what I mean? But the burden ain't on me because... It's gonna happen. Say, say, say with like, cause I know I don't know if Orlando, the ninety four one Orlando dude, if he from here, right. but I know he knows who Tom D is. Right. Tom D is one of the biggest artists in the area where he broadcasts his radio at. Did yeah. they ever try to reach out to you and say, "Hey man, we gonna cook, hook you up and lick you in with this person, this person, this person"? Yeah, no, nah, that's and, what they do. That's what they do, cause cause that's how I end up meeting Cool and Dre. Through Orlando, like everything I do, Orlando always support me. And Orlando got a very strong relationship. Okay, you know what I'm saying? Like some, from the outside looking in, a lot of people can look at it and say, um, "Well, damn, dog, why they ain't just running your shit in the ground on the radio?" But that ain't how it work. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. yeah but yeah, yeah. they have, like, I have had records that they done ran in the ground like a motherfucker. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? And I done done plenty wild splashes. I done done mm -hmm. plenty last damn shows. I go to the toy drives every time he do toy drives every year. You know what I'm saying? That's my homeboy for real. You know what I'm saying? Like, okay. it's, it's, it's bigger than just him being the PD from the radio station and me being somebody from the city that, you know, um, they feel like, oh, it's Tom G, your, your face should just be all over that station. But it, it low key is. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? It low key is. So, like, you know, that's my nigga. And, you know, people feel like probably like he should do more for local music around the way. But this ain't no, um, the way I look at it, that 90 for one, just not no station. That can just do, you know, for all the local acts. What they look for is for motherfuckers to get their grind on and make yourself known, like I had to do. Mm -hmm. Like it wasn't never no like nigga. I had to earn them people like respect and yeah. shit like that. Like I go in that motherfucker to the feet up right now. We family. I'm family with all the mixed DJs, all the motherfuckers and shit. You feel mm -hmm. me? The, the PD, the, the assistant PD, all that. But that was years in the making because you gotta make yourself known. You got to make your grind be seen, bro, so they can respect it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Heard, I don't know. You know, it's always a rumor mill going on, man, that you that, that you signed the deal after BET or after, <laughs> a, a, after, the, uh, after the song pop. Yeah. Is there any truth to that? No, no, no. I'm independent, man. You know what I'm saying? I got a situation with, 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 with Epidemic Music. Cool and Dre, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. They're my niggas, but we we independent, you know what I'm saying? We man in our own situation. We we don't we not finna put all this grind and all this work and effort into this shit for us to sign to some motherfuckers for them to be able to tell us, you know, 
what the fuck to do and when we can do it, how right, we can do it. Right, you know what I'm right. Saying? We ain't finna do that. Right. You know what I'm saying? What we gonna do is we gonna goddamn keep our situation uh, in house and we gonna tell y'all what we wanna do. Mm-hmm. You know, when I say that, I'm talking to the major labels. If we fuck with y'all, we gonna tell y'all what we wanna do, how we wanna do it, and when we gonna do it. Fair enough, fair enough. You know what I'm saying? Too deep in the game for that shit. Unless you motherfuckers come with some money. That with that real money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Real deal money. Yeah, I'm talking about life changing money. 70, 80 M's. Type shit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Anything you wanna get off your chest? I was just get ready for this new pressure that's finna drop. You know what I'm saying? I'm finna drop a lot of pressure, man. You know what I'm saying? That's what it is, nigga. We finna grind and we finna get it in. I got a movie coming out, but it's it's really it's really based on a story that I put out called Poison Pussy. Okay. If you never heard it, go on YouTube or, or Apple Music, listen to it, catch up with it. This shit is bigger than power, nigga. <laughs> I'm telling you, nigga. We gonna act out the whole motherfucking storyline. This shit gonna be crazy, bro. Cause when you listen to the song, you gonna feel like, damn, dog, why they ain't got no movie for this bitch already? So okay. we gonna act the whole shit out. Okay. Po- poison pussy, poison huh? Poison pussy. But we gonna call it poison the movie. Now, something that I do sometimes, man, with people, man, uh, call fuck one, marry one, kill one. Right. All right. Nah, you you, you know you know what fuck one, marry one, kill one is? Yeah, I know what it is. Okay, okay, okay. Now, uh, you ready for fuck one, marry one, kill nah, one, making nah. it on TV time, man? <laughs> What's up? No, nah, man, I ain't, I ain't, you trying to get me in a motherfucking argument when I get to that. <laughs> oh! But I got somebody oh. who will do it for me, though. Okay, okay, so, what uh. Mercat? What Merc at? Oh, we got to find Merc around here, huh? <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right, here we go. We, 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 we gonna, we gonna find Merc and we gonna, uh, set this here. Fuck one man, one kid, one. Making noise TV style. It's boy, Church Eden. All right, man, we got my boy Merc in the building, man. Making noise TV. What up, baby? What up? So, all right, look, man, we, we sitting down with Tom. Trying to do fuck one, marry one, kill one. Tom ain't with it. So, Tom bringing what's you up, on. Man, what's up? So, you going to speak for Tom and speak for yourself <laughs> speak today. For, you hey, gonna I don't put that on, bro. I'm speaking for myself. I'm going to do it like that. No, we going to... All right, all right. All right, we gonna, all right. Uh, these, um, these ladies have come in. Please, nobody get mad at me because this is this, people have gotten mad at me before by doing this. So, I'm going to put this disclaimer out. <laughs> I didn't pick these women. <laughs> Somebody sent me these women. You sure? And I don't, because I don't know none of these women. <laughs> man, this is a motherfucker. <laughs> okay. Hey, man, they, 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 they didn't got mad before, Tom. I'm telling you, man. All right. Uh, fuck one, marry one, kill one. Nova the Nymph. You know, you guys know who Nova, Nova the Nymph is, right? right? These are these are all, uh, I all think, right, 81813 uh, people. Okay. Nova the Nymph. Okay, uh, hold on. Uh, Girl, Mulatto, Emiliana, you know? Yeah. And um, Miss Red Carpet. Well, I like Miss Red Carpet. You like Miss Red Carpet? So fuck what's one man. One so fuck one what's, man, one kill one. one Nova the Nymph. Yeah, I know Nova. Mulatto, Emiliana. Okay, I think I know her. And Miss Red Carpet. Fuck one man, one kill one. Hey, Mulatto, she like a, she like red, red, she yeah. tatted, like yeah. mixed, like. Yeah. Whatever. Okay, all right, I know exactly who that is. Yeah. Okay, go ahead. Say it again. Nova the Nymph. Yeah. Her, Mulatto, Emiliano, uh-huh. and Miss Red Carpet. Fuck one, marry one, kill one. Fuck one, marry one, kill one. What you one. want me to start with? Hey, start with whatever you want to start with, man. You got to and you explain why. Shit, shit, shit. I'm going yeah. I'm to I'm I'm fuck Miss Red Carpet. Why? Cause I feel like I've been wanting that for a little minute, but I'm 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 gonna fuck Miss Red Carpet like. Oh, you want? Oh, you want that? Yeah. That what you said? Yeah. I done, see, I done got lap dance before, boy. I was, and shit, boy. I was in the trance, boy. Ooh. Shit, you feel me? Okay. I already, what they what they say? Well, you want nigga ready to throw it away? Mm. You feel me? You gonna risk it all, huh? Risk it all. That's what yeah. they say. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna fuck. Huh? Oh, all right. Um, what we going next? Kill the man. Right, man, that's it's on you. Tom ain't got nothing what to do. What you wanna do? Kill the man, Tom. I'm gonna do it. Man. <laughs> Tom putting this okay, game okay, out there. Okay, we gonna go nah. kill. We gonna go kill because that shit gonna get. You know, you gotta kill a bit, then you you ready for the happy ending. Mm, you know, okay. Marry somebody. All so right, it's your world. We gotta kill a bit. What her name? Mulatto. 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 You gonna kill Mulatto? Why you gonna kill Mulatto? Because I gotta marry Nova. You gotta. Oh, you gonna marry <laughs> Nova? Nova. Oh, oh, so you, why, so you really like Nova? That's why I'm gonna kill Mulatto because I gotta marry Nova. So I like you, that. I like that poetry, artsy type shit. Like mm-hmm. I like that vibe. You feel what I'm saying? You ain't trying to slide. I gotta in keep that in my life, and I know she got a side. 
You feel me? I know it's the other side to that shit. You ain't tried to slide in the DM yet. Shit. Uh, uh, look, uh, look. Uh, 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 even go holla out in person yet. You ain't. No, no, I'm gonna pull up. I'm gonna pull up. You gonna pull up? Smoke your word. That's her shit. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, I'm gonna mm-hmm. pull up. I done pulled up to a couple of them, but I was on dates. See? I'm, I'm scared of my girl. So you feel me? That's like a little cool little date night, but I'll be there with the vibe. Like, damn, bro, I'm gonna hop on stage. This boy going on a date trying to scope out something. Straight yeah, out. That's real. That's straight up. I'm I guess. Vibe. <laughs> All right, so you going so you going I'm a fuck uh, mad red, red carpet. I'm fuck red. I'm a, <laughs> I got to kill a lot of I don't want to, but I got to. Okay. Cause I got a marry no. Cuz you got a marry no. Straight up. Okay. Damn, how you doing dog a lot of Hey. Hey, next time I see it when I got something for it, man. Tom, what you game. think about what, what, what you think about that time? What you think what, what you think about how you pick, man? Oh damn! Well, I can't get. I can't. But well, I'm telling y'all, look, I can't get nothing for Tom. I can't get nothing for Tom right now, man. I'm trying to get some. Yeah, man. I'm, I'm trying to get it all, man. That's real now. Now, um, y'all got y'all two here today. Um, y'all did. Y'all just uh, collaborated on the song. Tell me about it. Uh, you know what I'm talking about? I came up with a little concept. What we gonna call that shit? That shit called Big Bad. Yeah, you feel yeah. what I'm saying? I got them big mad. You know what I'm talking about? Chasing yeah. Big Bad. You feel me? Yeah. Okay. So I got, you know what I'm talking about? It's for the uh, upcoming mixtape. You know what I'm talking about? Screwed for Life. Screwed yeah. for Life. Uh, Screwed for Life. Man, you know I took a, a, a high, I was on a high 80s. You heard me? Like, I ain't did shit in a minute, bro. Like, mm-hmm. Last time I was rapping, we did some of them. Yeah. We did a rich game. Yeah. You feel no, what I'm saying? Yeah. Damn, yeah. Minute, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? And I had, no, I had a, uh, a verse from a boy, you know what I'm talking about? <laughs> that shit like seven years ago. Long old. time ago. Threw, threw a nigga little key, you know what I'm talking about? So shit, I, I just felt like it was only right. You know what I'm talking about? Getting back on that shit, I got a, um, I got a track with Wade coming up. Okay, okay. So, yeah, yeah Rod Wade. I got Rod on the hook, you know what I'm talking about? That's all right. So I'm just trying to make some shit happen. You feel what I'm saying? That's what's happening. That's what's happening. Get back at it. You know what I'm talking? Screws back, baby. Screws back. Big screws. You feel me? Big screws. Yeah. Not, not, not. Uh, you doing the solo thing or you just? I mean, shit. Or y'all, y'all the group still. still rocking. You feel what I'm saying? But man, I had to, you know, had to get back on it. You know what I'm saying? This for me. You feel what I'm saying? Did my solo project. Coming out, this for me. You feel what I'm saying? But screw, we still on it. You know what I'm talking about? Okay, okay. Good. That's what's hell, man. Well, Shout out, screw. Hey, um, uh, I'm anxious to the for the for the people to hear what y'all put out, man. Yeah. That, that 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 was a fire track, man. That's a fire. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, uh, y'all make sure y'all stay on the lookout for the for the uh Merc Money Man Merc and Tom G collab. What's it called? Yeah. Big, Big Bad. Big Bad. Big Bad. Hey, look, man. Straight up. I got a question to ask you, Tom. Right. Uh, I, I don't know if anybody asked you this shit, but I know I know you know your voice. Yeah. It's a little it's a little raspy. Yeah. You uh, the, the only other person that I really can uh compare it to, but you can't compare it to is my dog Skip, man. Uh free soldier skip. Oh, I know yeah, you know, yeah, so, but, but, yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you were screaming a lot as a kid, or, or? Nah, I don't know <laughs> I have a kid. I don't know. This forever? Nah, but you know, the weird part about it, motherfuckers used to fuck with me when I was a chick, right? Cause when all my partners, when, they, when all they voices started getting beat, mine didn't. Mm. So they were like, yeah, hey, bro, put some bass in your boys. I'm like, nigga, I ain't got no <laughs> So I'm getting mad at myself, bitch. I'm like, damn, I ain't going through puberty or some shit. <laughs> I'm going through the same puberty that these niggas going through, growing hair and shit, but. <laughs> the voice just ain't go with it. Uh. You know what I'm saying? The voice ain't go like deep like everybody else shit. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. fuck it, I just took advantage of it. Then when I met David Banner and shit, yeah. he told me, he was like, nigga, you got a dope ass voice. He was like, nigga, pimp that bitch. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? He was like, pimp that bitch. He said, boy, bitch, gonna fuck with you. Pimp that voice. Nigga, you got a dope ass voice. And then ever since then, I went out just locked in on that shit. Like, that's when I realized, like, okay. But I knew I kind of had a dope voice before that, but he just solidified it for me, like, damn, okay. Okay. You know what I mean? yeah, that's real. That's real. That that this what we hearing in the background. What we hearing in the background. That, that, that's, that's the big bad. That's the big bad right here. Okay. Yeah. 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 Now, do you think that's something that people people look at and say, "Well, I I like him just cause uh, oh, his voice different." Definitely. Okay. You know okay. What I'm like when I do my challenges and all that shit, and then like 
you know, when I do my songs and shit, that's that's most of the feedback I get. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like motherfuckers be like, damn, that nigga voice like, you know, especially the females and shit. They be like, I like his voice. And yeah. Like, I can't eat all the food when I'm like in this area. You know what I'm nah, saying? you can't. <laughs> they are little so <laughs> Yeah. The top of St. Pete, Clearwater, Mad Four One, mm-hmm. all that shit. That the whole Central Florida, really the whole Florida. I'd be yeah. like, hey y'all, let me get a uh so and so. I told you. It sound like Tom, Tom G. I'd be like, nah, this is Mike. <laughs> <laughs> one nigga say, yeah, cause you know how they say, um, for better service, can I ask your name? So you know what I'm saying? And I said, well, my name Mike. <laughs> all right, pull to the to the front one, the Mike. Yeah, I know. When I get up, I think I knew this one no more. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Tom G, man. Tom, what you think your biggest song is? My biggest song? Your biggest song. With the females, it's that 100 rounds. That shit all in New Orleans. That shit all over the world. Man. Yeah. Like, Boy. Low key, that's the biggest motherfucking ass shaking song. Listen, right man. Now. Hold on, Rick. I'm sorry to cut y'all. Ever? Me. Your ever. biggest song? Your biggest no, song no, ever? Not, not my biggest song ever, but I'm talking about like. If you talking about females, right. that's the biggest that's Turk song low key right mm-hmm. there. But, oh. but my biggest song ever, 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 I don't even know, bro. I don't know. You know what I'm saying? I got a lot of them, bro. And all my shit touch people in different ways. You know what I'm saying? Like, I got on and on. You know what I'm saying? That's for the real street niggas. And I got closer to my dreams. That's for the real street niggas. I got, I got uh, Gamble. That's for... Just real life shit, you know what I'm saying? I got, I got so much shit, bro. I don't, I don't know what my biggest song is. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. What you think? Well, well, what you was gonna say? I was gonna say, bro, so crazy that he said one of his biggest songs is uh, Hundred Rounds." Cause listen, bro, me and my mama having a conversation because she fuck with me on the music shit, like we be yeah. rapping and shit. Yeah. She feel like she my manager, low key. So, like we rapping, and she say, "Man, you too, you too nasty, you too nasty, you too, you got, you got to calm down. You, I, you ain't gonna never blow if you talk like that." So. I say, nah, man, listen, they play this on the radio. And I play that 100 rounds for them. <laughs> they don't play that on the radio. <laughs> nah, they don't play I say, mm. man, I say, you just don't want to hear that from your baby. They play she it on the radio with a clean version. You, mm. Yeah, you mm. feel me? But they play, I, I listen, I say, man, come on, you just don't want to hear that from you, baby. That's all I need to do. She ain't want to hear that from me. That's what it is. Right, right, right. Yeah. Now, what made, like, what, what's the inspiration for that song right there? What, what made you come up with, like, man, look, I, 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 I want to do this here? I just said, fuck it, I'm just from, like, if you think about it, the whole motherfucking song when I first came, when that when that bitch dropped, from the time it dropped, it's automatically captivating. I just wanted to make some shit that just automatically make these chicks lose their fucking mind. So I just, you know what I'm saying, <laughs> drop some shit that just, uh, that bitch just come in, what's the problem You know what I'm saying, off top, mm-hmm. off top. And then by the time the beat gone, they already done lost their mind from the, when that bitch first dropped in. By the time the beat come, bitch, they been gone. Straight up. Straight up. <laughs> Straight up. <laughs> Any shout outs you want to give before we end right now, man. man. Shout out to everybody that been supporting since day one, been riding since day one. I fuck with you, nigga. You the reason why a nigga charged up. You know what I'm saying? The reason why a nigga finna take this shit to the ultimate level, man. I appreciate y'all. You know what I'm saying? From the bottom of my heart, real nigga shit, dog. And shout out to God, nigga, because without him, we ain't shit, man. Straight up. Merc. What up, baby? Hey, shout out to the whole 9 for 1 from Sarasota, Ramonia. Shout out to the whole Florida. You feel me? This is a takeover, man. Screw me back, baby. What can I do? All right, man. It's your boy, Church Easy. Making Noise TV. Got my man, Tom G, in the building. Got the boy, Merc. Big Merc. Money Man yeah, Merc. Big Whatever one. Well, big Scrooge. Yeah. If you ain't on Making Noise TV. You ain't making no motherfucking noise, nigga. You already know what time it is, man. We out here. I'm going to go. I took a break, but now I'm back, though. I hit your main beat. You hit the club. I hit the back, though. I'm a hustler. You a customer. Get your muscle up.